What's going on everybody? It's your boy Sticky Noodle here and in today's video I'm actually going to be talking about the possibility of modders on PS4 and Xbox One just next gen consoles in general. Before we get into this video I want to say that I'm giving away a free Megalodon shark card on Grand Theft Auto Online equal up to $8 million in Grand Theft Auto. I'm really just going to be giving it to the most active subscriber on my channel so really the only requirements that you have to do is just be active to my YouTube channel and be subscribed to my YouTube channel. And also if you guys could please drop a like on this video every like helps my channel out tremendously it would be greatly appreciated and it just helps this video get out to more and more people to let more and more people know about this crazy news and also if you guys can hit that subscribe button it'd be greatly appreciated really every subscriber just makes my day and just motivates me to keep on making content for you guys and hey you'll never miss another video from me i upload daily grand theft auto news and content just really anything that i feel like you guys my subscribers you out there should know so it seems that modders are actually starting to make their way on to grand theft auto 5 online and if you guys don't know what i mean you know the ceo and everything update just came out you just basically do a bunch of ceo stuff basically selling drugs on Grand Theft Auto. So are you guys actually worried about modders coming on to GTA Online on PS4 and Xbox One? It seems like that was the only safe place for, you know, just not being messed with by modders. But here lately, it seems that, you know, a lot of stuff has been going on with GTA Online servers and just GTA Online in general. And I'm sorry for just keep on reporting on this stuff, but there's actually a lot of stuff going on. And here recently, not only is the servers messing up and money stuff messing up, but there's also been like some sort of modern stuff going on in the servers of Grand Theft Auto Online. And really, I don't know if this is because the servers are just, you know, just shit right now and just people are just getting in somehow like that. I don't really know if, if it's just like a server problem or if it's just the modders found a way to just get in through the PS4, which is pretty scary to say the least because, you know, I enjoyed going into a lobby without getting fucking raped in my asshole. So it's been reported that players are actually doing CEO missions and trying to deliver packages and stuff and really the marker that you guys gotta deliver packages to is actually being blocked by this big old like crate thing it's really hard to explain if you guys see it y'all probably know what i'm talking about really if you're inside it while he like while the modder or whatever just drops it on you you're stuck if you're outside, you can't get in, so it's really a bummer if you're outside of it because you can't deliver your package, and really, it just forces you to leave the whole session, which is actually pretty, you know, pretty ass because if you leave the session, then you just lose money and you lose your time that you just spent doing that CEO mission as well as just money is just wasted. And we know how hard it is to make money in Grand Theft Auto Online, and, you know, it's just hard, and when you waste money, it's just a bummer. But it seems that modders are actually getting into the game somehow because with these crates, it's just, it basically just just spawns in like it just spawns in out of nowhere and the ability just to just spawn in something really what i know it as is modding you know hacking glitch and mod and whatever i don't really think it's a glitch but i really do think it's a mod now there has been actually some speculation saying that this is like a creator tool thing like a glitch where you can bring in stuff from the creator's menu when you create a job or something like that they saying it's a glitch where you can just bring in stuff and spawn in stuff in an online session but i haven't really seen anything like that but with modders actually finding their way if this is modders, this is bad. Rockstar Games need to step it up. They need to step up their security, step up their server problems, and I've actually seen like a few hidden updates come to Grand Theft Auto 5 online, and you know, I don't know if this them trying to fix it or what, but they need to fix it fast. Because honestly, when I see that money come in when I sell some drugs, you know, some good, some good lucky charms, if you know what I mean. I just, you know, just let one rip in my pants. And I know I'm not talking about a fart. You know, I just, you know, just let one go one long. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys got to hear this. I'm fucking weird. In all seriousness, guys, I hope you guys are not losing money out there. And I hope you guys are not being affected by modders because modders can actually ruin the game. And they make the game so hard to play with fun. No, but really, guys, it's actually a big problem. And I would recommend that you guys all tweet Rockstar Games or just, you know, fill out a support ticket saying that there's modders maybe or that there's some kind of suspicious activities as you know just showing like resemblance of modding or something like that get them to fix the game please if you guys did enjoy this video and you guys are having problems let me know what your problems are down in the comment section below i would love to hear what you guys are experiencing if you're not having any problems well good for you man you better just be loving grand theft auto right now you do you better just drop one just you know rub one out onto your ps4 or onto your grand theft auto disc it really doesn't matter because you you ran you my friend you watching right now that's not having any issues with grand theft auto you better thank god above because you you are one lucky motherfucker but if you guys did enjoy this video please let me know down in the comment section below what i can do to improve my videos and like i said hey i'm giving away a free megalodon shark card so hit that subscribe button if you guys did enjoy please drop a like on this video every like once again helps my channel get out there and just helps this video get out there to more and more people let more and more people know that rockstar is trying to slide a roofies in your drink
drink. No, but not seriously, guys. Every like is appreciated. It just really does help this video get out there to more and more people. And if you guys to leave a subscribe on this video, you know, you're just new to the channel and you've never seen any of my videos before. I basically upload Grand Theft Auto news and information. Just really anything that I feel like you guys should know. So why not, you know, hit that subscribe button. You'll never miss another video from me. Hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know what I can do better to improve my videos. And yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope you guys are all having a great day. Once again, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Everything is just appreciated. Hope you guys are having a good day. This is your boy Sticky Noon, and I'm out. Peace. God bless.